Hi guys, so it's been a while since last time I spoke to the camera in English But I guess it's time to bring you my favorites for the month of January and February So before I get started, I have two things I want to mention The first thing is do not worry there will be subtitles in the video So you'll be able to understand what I say the Second thing is like I really love my English journal series But I kind of figured that uh, it's not everyone's cup of tea I decided that from now on I will probably just make my English video into like a monthly or bi-monthly favorites. I'm not gonna film every single month because I want to really gather my thoughts on things that I like instead of just like force myself to like something so I have something to talk about. Does that make sense? Yeah. So the first category is going to be music. So I don't necessarily have a specific type of music that I like absolutely love or obsess. I just kind of listen to all different kinds of music from different um, platforms on Spotify or on YouTube. I don't know, so recommendations from you guys. So the first is Lily by Ellen Walker. So because of some work opportunities, I started listening to all his like most popular songs like Faded or Diamond Heart. Like so many different songs that I'm like, oh my God, so good. And then I came across the song Lily. It's more of like, it's very dark. It's like a dark fairy tale. The song itself is so addicting. I'm gonna play it right now and I'm sure, like I'm 100% sure that the song will stuck in your head as well. I feel like I can picture this in some sort of movie like Alice in Wonderland in real life and that's what I would picture the song to be so the next song it's called Dear Insecurity by Nash and Ben Abraham it's more of the lyrics that grab my attention and really like stuck in my head so I'm gonna read some lyrics for you guys to understand more of what I'm saying some days when I wake up I see myself in the mirror my nose to my clothes from my chin to my skin I'll never be good enough ever again did I do something wrong this feelings unfair I overthink everything till my thoughts are impaired I hate everything about me I think I need some air and I love the last part I am proud of the person who I am I am taking my life into my hand and I feel like this is a struggle that a lot of people are struggling with because in reality this is very difficult to like ignore what people think about you and just be yourself like it's so easy to say than to do Lalo? Did I do something wrong? The feelings are there. You are making me anxious, but the fuck do I care? I love it to the moon and back. If you listen to the song and you're addicted to it, please let me know. And that makes me feel like I'm a normal person. <laughs> so yeah, those are two of my music favorites and I hope you guys will listen to it. So the next thing I want to share about is actually a perfume. Actually wearing it right now, if you can smell, no you can. I remember this was my very first perfume that I ever bought. This is like the most um, pleasing girly perfume I ever smelled. It's more floral than fruity, but it's not like mom kind of floral. Does that make sense? And I think this is good for like teenage girls to like me, like 25 to even 30. Just like twist it and you spray it like this. Yeah, convenient. I love it. Great. The next thing I want to talk about is actually something that's on my lip right now. If you can see, I love the color. It kind of matches my eye makeup today. <laughs> it is called a Shine Chick Lip Lacquer. So I saw this in Hong Kong when I was just like window shopping and I came across E2 House. It's actually a tiny bit different from the packaging. It's very comfortable on the lip. I said that to all my lip products, but it's actually really comfortable to wear. Besides, I think this will go well with a lot of different outfits and it can be dressed up or it can be dressed down. Here comes why it's in my favorites. So next I would like to talk about my favorite channel recently. So the first is Hi I'm Mimi. I think I've mentioned this in my previous like YouTube recommendation videos. She hasn't posted in a while but I recently went back to her channel and just watched her old videos. Her style is just so simple and it's like talking to a friend over the screen and I just love the overall vibe from her channel. This is a tour of my Fiala and Konkin mini backpack which is the actual way you pronounce it. Oh my god! Start it. Okay, so I'm gonna start off with these earrings. I got these earrings and I think they're beautiful. Like they're honestly my favorite pair of earrings ever. But I still wish she can post more videos so I can watch them. So yeah, 
The second channel is called Hailey Fam. I started watching her when she had like 200k and now she has almost 2 million subscribers which is crazy. She is definitely sarcastic. I don't know where to put this. I'm just gonna put this right here. But then it looks like my... I like her honesty. I like how ambitious she is. And I also really enjoy her content. I have been wanting to do another $100 challenge. I'm kind of a beauty and fashion YouTuber again. Try on my thrifted outfit now and we'll see how it compares. This is my thrifted outfit. Still need to cut the bottoms off these jeans. If you have not yet watched her video, you should go check it out because I love her. And next round, we have the food favorites. Can I not include a food favorites? This is the kind of spicy peanuts from Tianren. I can eat like one third of a pack a day. This is how much I love it. It's get the, per oh my God. And by the way, if you try it and you like it, it's buy five, get one free. And my last favorite is actually this notebook. Past two months, I started going back to writing things down. I almost forgot how much it helped me to kind of gather my thoughts and organize what I do. I feel like there are a hundred things in my brain that I want to do, but I can only do like one at a time. Being able to list everything and just give priority to each of them really helps me to get my productivity up and just remind myself not to get too ahead of myself and just not get to overwhelm either. I guess this is a little bit self-explanatory, but yeah. Okay, I feel like today's video is not very interesting. It's just me murmuring different things I love and I hope you guys will enjoy it. Please let me know if you have any favorite things in the past two months and I would love to know what you've been loving. Also, please let me know if you have any music recommendations. I would love to explore more as well. I'm planning to do a music playlist video and if you want to watch it, please give this video a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel. Maybe turn on the notification bell. Have a wonderful day. See you in my next video. Bye! vivid and just like hi i'm here you know what i mean so let me just search it up like, i'm 100 percent sure that you're gonna like stuck in your head and jake rob with her castle i don't know their insecurity